You know, if there's any place in the world that I will really never like in any way, shape, or form, uh, and no, it's not your mother's bedroom, it's uh, Penny's. Oh god, I don't feel too good. <coughs> oh god, sorry, I haven't felt too good ever since Penny's got the new freaking extension in Waterford. Yeah, and that was years ago. I mean, don't lie, we all really do want to end whenever your mother is like, oh, to Penny's now for a quick look. I won't be a minute. Don't worry about it. Blah, blah, blah. And you know, it really bakes my beans. And I mean, it's just the fact that you're being led to your inevitable death by just strolling around the shop filled with flipping knock off horse piss i mean i personally don't enjoy wandering around a shop with the flipping dog poo shoes that were all made wear as a child and i mean like the kid who turns up to pe in penny's shoes like uh, i'm sorry son but you are getting smacked but no seriously i don't know how mammies are entertained by flipping walking around the shop filled with like skinny jeans that suit her big 57 year old booty. Or uh, I can't be the only one who hates the flippin' voice of cash in number seven, please. I mean like seriously, that voice, it freaking gets to me. Or uh, is it just me or is Penny's always a place that your mother happens to meet her long lost cousin or like her friend who she used to work with i mean i don't know about you guys but i hate standing around for like three hours and pennies reading like the tags off cardigans while your mother talks to aunt belinda about theresa who's in hospital but yeah that pretty much sums up pennies what a flipping shithole but uh, anyway moving on to the next topic i want to talk about and uh loom bands Ooh. E <sighs> yeah Remember them? Remember coming home from school and then strolling up to the shop to buy like four packs of loom bands with all your mates? Yeah, great banter. And, like, I'm not even lying here. I was a freaking beast at making loom bands, not even joking. Seriously, like, me and my sister at home cooking up some flipping cheesy loom bands, like, you freaking don't know. Yeah, like, I just remember going into fourth class and, like, just showing all my friends all my loom bands. Jesus Christ, those were the days. I mean, I even I remember one time when me and my fam went up to uh, Kilkenny to the car boot sale and uh, yeah, guess what? Now they weren't selling the packets of loom bands. They were literally selling proper made loom bands, you know, like flipping bracelets and necklaces like Jesus Christ. What on earth? Yeah, for 250. Imagine paying that for a loom band bracelet like Ah! Or does anybody remember those cringy tutorials on how to make loom bands everybody would watch? I mean, I remember that particular one, For Made by, by mommy. mommy. I mean, like, I remember at the time, I thought, I mean, that was just freaking brilliant making videos about loom bands, but, uh, yeah, that changed. But yeah, Jesus, loom bands. Holy moly. Or, uh, uh, I don't, I don't know, do parents still do this, but, uh, my mother used to always, uh, you know when they, like, spit in their hand and they wipe that flipping Nutella off your face? Yeah, Christ, uh, that was, uh, rough. Not gonna lie. I remember just sitting outside of school in the car before, you know, I got out of the car to go to school. Uh, my mother would be like, oh, oh, you have a few cookie crisps on your face. Come here, Lana. Come here now and I wipe that off. Again, I don't know, did your mothers do that? I mean, mine did, and it was just ah. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much the rant video I'm gonna do for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, yeah, don't forget to comment your opinions down in the comments below. And guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and guys, I'll see you next time. Peace.